Okay, it's night time, ladies and gentlemen. Step, yep, okay, step right up. You want a beer? I got the beer for your knee. There you go, lady, have a beer. Fantastic. And meanwhile, in a pub near you. Ah, how you doing, guys? This is Hybrid Steel. Welcome to Brew Pub Simulator. Gonna be honest, I'm, yeah, after having a little bit of a tiz was with this game, I'm actually enjoying it. It's, it's pretty cool. So, I can't even remember what I'm supposed to be doing. Brew the beer, create a keg of beer, matching the requirements, and send it to via the delivery. Oh, I think I know what I've got to do. Let me just read this. Uh, Alright, I found a renovation team that could take care of the expanding your space. The problem is that the team won't lift a finger until they've got nine litres of beer. Right, okay, I think that's, yeah, gotcha. Which will provide them with a reason to abandon their current job. During the renovation of the city hall, they ate all of our donuts. They must have had a sweet tooth. Perhaps that's a clue on how to hit their taste buds. Okay, so I've got to make a beer that's really, really sweet. Like chocolatey, I suppose, isn't it? So, um, yeah, okay, we're going to ditch this. And we're going to start this again. I need to find some sweet stuff. Now, how do I do this if that... Right, okay, let's have a look at my uh, stuff. Okay, cool. So, cocoa powder. I'm going to assume we could use that instead of hops. Or do we do... This is what I'm not... Do I have to put hops in... I, I don't know. Do I have to make a chocolate beer? American malt. So, that's malt. That's light malt. What the smeg do I have to do with this? I don't really know. Um, smegity smeg smeg smeg. Right. Okay. Do I have to make a do I have to make a beer for this? Okay. So that's cinnamon, berry, beetroot, ginger, mint. Okay. I think we got some mint. Um. Okay. Light malt, cocoa powder. I don't know if it's going to work. Some but we'll uh, see chocolate, how American going. chocolate malt as well. I'm not sure how well this is going to go, and we're just going to go from there. I might have to buy this milk stuff as well because this is milk. It, we've sh it's milk sugar. So I'm just trying to like pound in as much as possible into this right now. Maybe add some vanilla. Yeah, cool. Order. This is going to be a weird one because I'm going to be trying to make something that I have no idea if it's going to work or not. It's going to be weird. So uh, apparently, it probably still has to be a beer. Yeah, that, that's what I'm getting at. This is what this is why I think it's going to be a really weird mix. So, we have our mint here, which is good. I also have lemon. Lemon is for something else. That's okay. We did lemon. Uh, okay, so we've got mint. We've got 200, 400. Inventory. I've got my, yep, my extract. Inventory. That one. Cool. Next, I've got my cocoa powder. Don't know how this is going to... Whoa, that's a big bag. Where can this go? Uh, on the floor. That will do. All right, cool. Uh, lactose milk sugar. I have no idea what I'm truly doing. And vanilla powder. Now, I'm going to put my vanilla powder up. Vanilla? Vanilla. Okay, cool. So, unfortunately, there is no, like, recipe to follow. I've literally just got to brew something that this might work. I don't know. The first thing that we've got to do, really, is make up a malt. Now, this is malt. But this is chocolate malt. I don't know how I've got to... I mean, I normally put 130... That's malt extract and that's malt. Don't know what I've got to do. It's all going to... Okay, we're just going to do some experimentation. Then. Cool. Right. Let's fill this up to... Uh, let's go eight, seven litres. We've got to do nine litres of liquid. 730 seems about right. Okay, cool. How much would I normally put in? 130. So that's 500 grams. I yeah I mean uh, let me just pick this up a second would I put would I be putting 500 grams in no I'd be putting 500 mil in I have no idea what I'm doing maybe this isn't supposed to be that complicated okay let's try just brewing a beer okay so we need a thousand three hundred of that stuff uh dun, 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 dun. cascade hops we need 10 grams okay cool so that's those ones I think maybe I'm supposed to use the other ones as well. I don't really know. Okay, so this is first off, we've got to like cook this up, and then we add our cocoa powder to it as well. I might add the vanilla to it. As well. I'm still not sure what I'm doing with this. Maybe that'll get like explained to me later on. I don't know. But for now, let me just boil this up, and then we'll see where this goes. Okay, so that's on cool down now. Now I've got to wait until we've got this in. So we've got to wait until this gets down to 21 degrees. Okay, 21 degrees. Get the yeast. Yeast. Chuck five mil into there. Excellent. 
Right, now we gotta pour this into here. So this way, eight liters and 76. We can, we might be able to make that a little bit bigger. Right, so now I wanna tip five milligram of this in. I'm gonna put some vanilla in here as well. And where's the mint? I'm gonna stick some mint in here as well. Put some sugar and milk in here. By the way, I have no idea what I'm doing. This is all an experiment. Now what we want to do is we need to fill about a litre's worth of water in here. I'm hoping that's going to be about right. And now we have to come back in a couple of days' time, apparently. So that's going to be in fermentation. I've got 11 litres of left in my actual stuff. I have no idea if this is going to be any good, so I'm just going to go and serve some customers now. See how things go. Uh, we've got our glasses set up already. As you can see, my five glasses, even though I, I swear I had six, but apparently customers keep breaking them, so it's all fun and games. Anyways, we need to make some money. Okay, it's night time, ladies and gentlemen. Step, yep, okay, step right up. You want a beer? I got the beer for your knee. There you go, lady, have a beer. Fantastic. And meanwhile, in a pub near you. I always do this, like... This is just a way that I prep because this game is a little bit finicky when it comes to like trying to do stuff like you're fine just pouring drinks. It's fine. It's okay. But as I've only got 11 liters left of my mix, I literally have to just chill and see. And I'm doing $5.89 a litre a pint, which is amazing. Oh, she broke a glass. Bloody customers. Do you know how much glasses cost? I'm sorry. I haven't got any boot root beer. But you can definitely have some of that stuff. Apparently it's ladies night tonight. The only customers I've served are ladies. How you doing lady? Have a beer on me, it's fine. Oh yes it's ladies night. And the feeling's right. Oh yes it's ladies night. Oh what a fright. Oh what a f- <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah I know I'm funny. Oh yeah. Laugh it up. Excuse me madam, would you like a beer? Have a beer. Congratulations. Let me just wash up these dirty glasses. Would you like another one? There you go. Don't get too drunk now. We're going to be doing something you might question in the morning. Oh, yeah. Washy, washy. <laughs> Excuse me, lady. You've been quite a long time in that restroom. What are you doing? Oh, you are back. Good night. Have a great time. My door almost fell off the hinges. Yes, I remember the war as well. <laughs> Those damned aliens. But we did capture the brain bug. Yeah, I, I can. Yeah, I remember those times. Thank you very much for your custom. Have a great evening. Oh, yeah, the glasses are still clean. <sighs> it's been a good night so far. Good night. I mean, yes, okay, there's not as many tables as there as I like to go for. But $14 worth of tips, not too shabby if you're asking me. All we gotta do is wait for the last few customers to come through the door because we're down to our last six litres of beer. Oh, and this is Hybrid's beard. This is like my prime beer at the moment, mainly because it's um, it's fire. How long the beer will be exciting for the customer? Yes, they leave higher tips. So the best thing you can do is to brew a new beer every sort of like five days and just live off the income. If you can get a five star beer, people will pay a shed ton more for it. It just works out better for you. Hi, right, sir. Have a Hybrid's beard. It is a great beer. I mean, it's five stars, it's got that zesty, fruity flavour to it, and you can drink loads of it, and it'll, it won't mess you up too badly, sir. It's an amazing beer, if I do say so myself. Madam, you look quite short. Would you like a stool? So I'm cleaning, so give me a second. There we are. Would you like a hybrid beard? I should start asking people what they want. They can either have that or they can leave. It's completely fine. Oh yeah. How is the service for you guys tonight? Thank you very much. Oh, did you enjoy that, sir? If you'd like another one, just step up to the bar. Yes? Of course, I completely agree. How was your evening? You enjoying yourself? Do you need to go to the toilet like everybody else seems to go? Everyone seems to go to the toilet right after they've had a pint. Like, one pint, they're done. Lightweights. You want a number one? Hybrid's beard. There you go. Beard, beard, beard. I want to drink a beard. There we go, sir. Thank you very much for your custom. It's most appreciated. Just give me a second, lady. I'll be right with you. Have a hybrid beard. It's a lovely beer. Yeah, I completely agree. It's, it's just such a nice night out tonight. There's no rain in the skies. We're doing all good. Let me just clean up a little second. Thank you. Hey, yes. There you go, sir. Fresh one for you. Have a great evening. Let me just clean up here. Sorry. Sparkly clean. 
Not doing too bad. $29 in tips, man. That's good. Would you like another one, lady? You would. Enjoy the hybrid's beard. Yes, you can stroke it as well. I'll give you permission. It's fine. It reminds me of my days back when I used to work in clubs as DJ. I was like, everyone used to come up to me, Can I stroke your beard? Can I stroke your beard? Yeah, sure. Now he just repulses people. Oh, it's all smelly. <laughs> and that's just my kids. <laughs> oh, good times. Hey. It's been a good evening. I've, I've actually enjoyed tonight. Good, good crowd. Good crowd. Last orders. Have a great night. Thank you very much for popping by. Hybrids Waterhole. And there you go. We made 102 bucks. We're doing good. $235 in the old tinny. We're all right. Ah, there we are. Now I've got to go and see if this beer that I've brewed is going to be any good. Hopefully it'll be all right. But I, you never know. Right, let me just uh, clean this one up, get the water in. All good. So at some point, I'm probably going to have to order some new glasses because I've only got four spare left. People keep breaking them, man. It's not good. It's not good. Let me just put these four over here because normally what I do is I have ten glasses out, but I've only got nine left. And the reason why is just customers. They just come in, they break them. So I can I can sort of see it from like a, a bartender's point of view now. After someone, I, I used to be one of those people that used to um, like take glasses. So yeah, I'd feel very, very annoyed. I'm actually, I'm really, really like sorry for if anybody ever watches this and they remember me. I'm not going to call you and tell you my name, but if you ever remember me, I'm really sorry. <laughs> All right, we've got three liters left of the hybrid's beard. I mean, if we do one more, we could order up one more. They are expensive though. My beer is really expensive. Like we're looking at $165 a pop right now. Now the lemon effect. This is the one I'm actually sort of. This is the a good one. If I bring this in as well, it's $165, but it will make us money. And it's got five days worth of being excited about as well. So we can have the lemon effect, which is the one I'm brewing now. That's the one I've brewed already, and that's a good one. Have I got another tube? I have another tube. Now, I don't know how this works. Do I just connect like all the beers to one pipe? Or do we actually buy new pipes? I want to see what this does. I'm going to have to probably go through another day. So I'm going to stick up this. So this is a citrus uh, and a sour, and this is just hybrid's beard. Yeah. So do I just plug this in here as well? I do. Oh wow. Okay. So I, I'm gonna assume then we're like doing joints here. I'm not as in joint joint, but you know what I mean. So we've got two days left of hybrid's beard, and then we're on to the lemon effect, which is lovely. So yeah, we got the lemon effect. So I'm gonna have to start asking people what they want now. Excellent. Well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna skip through this day which is going to suck for the customers and then we're going to see if my beer's ready it's a four star so that's not bad i'm going to call this uh, vanilla mint vanilla mint and i'm just going to keep it at that and i'm not going to worry about it all right and then i'm going to shut my pub so yeah we spent 165 dollars but i did have to buy a new keg right okay let's go and oh, well, there's a bit of clean up in here it's dirty Right, let me just put my locker back. I may have to buy another table out here just to see if we can get more going. Okay, so this beer is now ready. It's 9 litres and 71, so that's good. We'll stick that up there. I do need another tube. Stick that up there. Stick that down there. Bob's your uncle. Let's accept this mission now. So, this need, it needed to be a 3 star. It needs to be done in 9 litres. We are done with this. I'm hoping this one will be enough. If it's enough... Then it's all good. Bong, 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 in. There we go. All right. Now what I need to do is I need to um, skip forward the day. The construction team is thrilled with the beer. You can commission the expansion of your premises from your tablet in the upgrade section. The beer hit th their tastes so well that after finishing the job, they'll all come to your bar. You'll definitely recognize them all at first glance. They are true workhorses. Rewards? Hey, so they liked the beer. Hey, guys, I am a mad scientist and I'm blipping loving it. Let's do this. All right, cool. So I still don't know what I'm doing with this stuff. I might, I don't really, I don't want to move it at all. Okay, so I do need to connect up my beer again. I need to move this. I need to connect this. So let's put these back on the menu. Oh, I'm so glad that was fun. Right, okay. 
think I'm gonna that's what I'm gonna start using this for mint so putting mint vanilla and cocoa into something was just a ma that was like me thinking outside the box of like hey little Lou little Lou um, yeah that worked I'm well happy with myself <laughs> oh yeah right okay so I've got extract extract I think if I move the 200 mil stuff that I've got like just sparingly left aside we'll put that up there put that up there that's a 200 that's a 1500 okay cool and then these are my other ingredients so I'm gonna need to pick up some more yeast soon I'm gonna pick up some more hop soon and we're gonna get some lemon I do want a bigger container but unfortunately going by what I've seen I can't quite unlock these yet but once I do it's gonna be so much better beer wise this the vanilla mint is it's only $141 because it's only a four star beer it's not a five star beer but look at the days on it it's got it's got a seven day love on it that's blinking good so all I need to do is I need to make more money I just need to make more money more money and more money now unfortunately what I need to do first off is I need to expand I need to make this look pretty now what I would like to do is bring in some more chairs some tables some bits and pieces maybe get some uh, actual benches in here we'll see what we can do let's have a look well, we still can't do darts yet that's a bit of a shame we have got bar stools though which means more people can sit down now do I want traditional wooden ones or do I want to go for slightly metal ones because I actually don't mind the metal ones too much they're you know more contemporary gives the bar a little bit more of a sort of like industrial feel instead of the wooden feel that's I, I'm sort of feeling like the industrial look on stuff I really do like that in in how I do stuff okay so I think let's buy four of these I'm gonna buy four better yeah I'm gonna buy four stalls and then we're gonna be putting them out in places so let's have a look inventory bar stall can we not why can't we put them there oh it's because I got the decorations in front okay cool uh hold down that button drag them this way cool that way I'm gonna put one here and then I'm gonna put the other one there so we can actually have people sitting around the bar as well that's pretty cool I like this all right that's all right that's all right and that's all right fantastic and feel like I'm pro I might need some more glasses at some point we've only got nine left so again I'll have to think about how I'm gonna do with that can we buy some decor you know make this place look a bit nicer because I'm gonna be honest shit oh we have shelves oh book okay, okay. decoration hey a beer sign oh cool yeah we're having one of those a napkin holder tempting new floors bits of pieces like that you know what I do like the idea of having like a dark floor and that wooden floor I, I think that would suit me more than anything else i don't know how this is going to work let's just let's just find out shall we i got 44 dollars left so we're doing okay okay so beer sign where do i put a beer let's let's find out crazy jimmy is on the case oh cool okay yeah it's actually it's an actual beer sign does it go on the bar oh oh okay i got gotcha. you oh that's cool i like that right okay and what was the other thing i bought flooring oh yeah i bought floor um troll this one. Oh yeah i like this this is like more me i do like the mis misshaped wood stuff it, it is more what i like i like it i know most people are probably gonna sit there going that's that's disgusting but you know what it's my taste it's not yours but if you do like this hit the like subscribe and notification button below below for all other updates that's gonna be cool anyways i would say that we've uh, successfully carried on a little bit into this now we're all good i've got beer flowing I've got a kitchen that's actually not too badly laid out now. It's all right. And we've got two beers in. We've got our minty one and we've got our normal one. Unfortunately, I'm probably going to run out of my normal one, which sucks. But I can brew another one. If I really, really needed to, I can just brew another hybrid's beer. Because it, it's not very difficult. It's very sort of... A, it's, a, it's the simple beer. If you want to know how to... If you want to know how to brew hybrid's beard, follow this recipe right here for everything you'll need. Water, light malt, cascade hops, and yeast. That's it. And then you make a five-star beard, and it's all good. Okay, cool. So I've got an... Un oh, hold on. Debt notification? I'm writing in respective to the Reclaim Solutions Debt Collection Company. I would like to inform you about the necessary of repaying the final instalment of the loan taken out by your grandfather. The repayment is $3,000. Failure to do so will result in the enforcement officer auctioning off the brew pub. Payments can be made through your tablet. You what? Ah, oh, ball. Unknown. You've probably already noticed, but some people don't behave normally. They have so much strength, they almost get unhinged doors. They stop in strange places. Sometimes they just pretend to drink beer or do so something at their deviance from normal behavior. 
In reality, they're collecting data. They are among us, and they don't want our brains at all. They want our beer. Okay, cool. So I need to pay. I need to pay two, three thousand dollars. How do I pay my loan? Is this how I got to pay the loan? Pay off debt. Holy crap! I got to pay three grand. Oh man. Okay, so that just means I've got to, I've got to make more beer than what I'm doing. Radio. So I, I would like to do this, but this is going to cost me an absolute fortune. So yeah, the what, how I was going to make money was I was going to basically buy kegs of beer and sell them. I mean, profit on a keg of beer plus the amount of money I would actually make from it probably works out about ninety dollars a keg. That's going to suck. So what I need to do is I need to go down the cheap route. I need to f quick. I need to basically ferment my own beers and just have loads of little beers. Well, I mean, we can start making. We can really get into some mad scientist stuff here. We got some mint. We got vanilla. We got cocoa. We got some malt. I mean, I've got enough to make one more at least, and um, we've got enough hops and stuff to make something special. So, join me in the next video where I'm gonna. I need to start saving up money. I need to make more money. In order to make more money, I'm gonna have to expand out the bar. So, in the next video, we've got to make two hundred, expand the bar. And hopefully, I get some sort of staff. Because there is, I think this is a staff icon right here. But I don't know just yet. Which sucks. Oh, you know what? I like this. My lo poster with my logo in it. You know what? I like that. I'm going to buy it. No, I'm not. I've only got $40. And I can't spend $30 on a neon sign. I'll do it when I've expanded the shop. Until then, guys, thank you very much for kicking by. This has been Hybrid Steel, and this has been Brew Pub Simulator. If you do like it, hit the like, subscribe, and notification button below for all the updates. And I'll see you all later on. Say peace out. Have fun. Enjoy everything you guys do. And don't get too drunk in the Brew Pub. Bye-bye for now.